What is the original Brown Betty teapot? This little teapot has quite the history with its origins dating back to the end of the 17th century. The teapot started off as a small, unglazed, and it was made with special red terracotta clay discovered in the area of Brattle Woods near Stoke and Trent, Staffordshire, England. Today, the Brown Betty teapot is still made in Stoke and Trent with the same clay from the original area, and British people believe the Brown Betty teapot makes the best cup of tea. It has better heat retention, and secondly, the shape of the teapot allows the leaves to swirl freely while they're steeping. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to make the perfect pot of tea in your Brown Betty teapot. Before you get started, you're going to want to rinse the pot in warm water before you make your tea. That's going to allow it to warm the pot and it's going to make sure that you're not going to be absorbing too much heat from your tea while you're making it. Grab your favorite loose leaf tea and you're going to add one teaspoon to two teaspoons per cup to the pot directly. Now when you're using your brown buddy teapot, you're not going to heat the water directly in your pot. Instead, you're going to use a kettle and you're going to heat the water in that. Now we recommend always using cold filtered water in your kettle and bring it to a boil. You're going to want to use the optimum temperature for brewing by the type of tea that you're using. White and green teas are going to be brewed with water just off boiling because they're more delicate, but if you're brewing a black tea, use boiling water. Once the water reaches the proper temperature, you're going to pour it carefully over the leaves in the teapot, allowing the leaves to move through the water. And the more surface area that the tea leaves are exposed to, with that is going to make for a better cup of tea. Now there's no need to overfill the teapot to get the required amount of tea. There's plenty of room without overflowing. In fact, the two cup Betty holds over three cups of tea. So after you've filled your teapot, you're going to put the lid on and allow it to steep. You're going to steep your tea for two to five minutes depending on your type of tea. Now just like we heated our teapot, I recommend rinsing or heating your teacups as well. That's going to allow your cup to stay warmer after you pour it. Now once you've steeped your tea, you're going to simply pour it into the cup. Now do remember that when you have loose tea in here, so if you're not pouring carefully, you may get leaves in it. You can also use a strainer and pour your tea through the strainer to catch any leaves that may come out. Whether it's the clay, the pot design, or a combination of the two, the tea poured from a Brown Betty teapot is said to be more flavorful and less bitter than the same tea brewed in another pot. The perfect cup of tea. Check out our large variety of loose leaf teas and more online at EnglishTeaStore.com or feel free to call us at 877-734-2458 to place your order today.